Ja, in ieder geval geluid zo te zien, dus dat is mooi. Mogen wel een hoop stream weer hebben, want een stream PC heeft uh, driver update en een Windows update. Mm -mm. Eens even kijken. Oh ja, we hadden hier uh, aan tot de conclusie komen uh, dat de krant uh, nog wat uh, ook uh, hipnapt was. Op waar ik kan tellen. En foes. Can hold. Nee. Twee. Dingen te hebben. Even kijken. Uh, oh, dat is naar die patroon. Dat is die mountain pass. Dus ik denk dat we eerst eens even. Nog geen short rest meer. Kampje gaan. Met wisselen. Uh, Orion. Ga je even bijhouden? Nee. Niet. Aangeven aan jou. Blijven. En te rage Op haar hou. In de stier. Dus die dat. Voilà, die was wel gaaf. Um, haar wel Wat zou het zijn? Nee. Oh, wat ik heb. Kom on. Doe van die. Echt. Oh ja, hier al de, de, de bol zit. Nee, omdat het de hele tijd maakt. Ik ga keel pakken. Keel op zich, die magic missile is erg fijn. Dan ga ik eens een keer gaan uh, voelen. Hij is een roep. Dan gaan we maar gewoon. Oh, 
Hello. Quite the cozy setup you have here. I'll just make myself comfortable. Thank you. My research turned up a rather brilliant technique that seems quite actionable. Okay. It's not too deep. Just behind the orbital socket. I could attempt an extraction. I've a needle in my tunic after all. Uh, thank you. You won't find a more learned opinion on this matter, I assure you. I don't need them. You only have a matter of days to live. Don't dally, my friend. That's a pretty cool. Huh? Quite the cozy setup you have here. Hey. Will's brows furrow as your minds connect. He sees the burning embers of Joaquin's rest, then Floric's face as she tells you of Raven God's abduction. Hells, older Raven God's been taken. Oh yeah. Then we need to seek him out and get him to safety. You see. Grand Duke Ravenguard is my father. I know I haven't said our relation was no matter of pride, not least for him. Okay. <laughs> you heard right. My father and I were close once upon a time, until he disowned me and cast me out of Baldur's Gate. Such a rift isn't so easily mended. But it's not so wide that I'd let my own father suffer at his captor's hands. <laughs> I've been asking myself the same question. What makes a Duke of Baldur's Gate so interesting to the drow? Even the houses of Menzo Baranzen would have little use for my father. No, this is no drow plot. These absolute nutters, these true souls are behind his abduction. His absence alone will sow chaos in the city. If they were to infect him, he could lead Baldur's Gate to ruin. All the more reason to find him. The absolute has seized not just my father, but the future of the Sword Coast. Yeah. I know, and you're right. When I look into a mirror, I see two faces. I see the Blade of Frontiers, a man hunting the fiends who prey on the weak and claw at the coast. And I see Will Ravenguard, a memory of a memory, a man who belongs to the past. I wanted you to know the blade, not the shadow he left behind. Um, I can't show oh. Ah, here. What can I do you for? Really? Really, really? 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 Yes. Oh, fine. And pay. Pay Piash meat. Carlac's all fire and fury. Uh, that's the spirit. Right back. Okay. Uh, I've seen. Uh, I've seen. I've
Here we go, go on. Gonna uh, and get My condition here. likes being ignored as little as I do. I must consume another artifact. And soon. Thank you. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Good gods. It hardly has any effect. Oh, Mr. Have mercy on us all. Listen, I need to speak to you, to all of you. It would be unconscionable of me to remain silent. Oh. I might just be about to remedy that. You have to know who I was. You have to know who I really am. What I am is a walking shadow of the promise I once held. I'm what one might call a wizard prodigy. Who from an early age could not only control the weave, but compose it. Much like a musician or a poet. Such was my skill that it earned me the attention of the mother of magic herself. The Lady of Mysteries, the Goddess Mistra. She revealed herself to me and she became my teacher. In time, she became my muse, and later even my lover. Okay. I am, after all, the villain of the tale. We enjoyed each other's company, body, mind and soul. But even so, I desired more. You see, no matter how powerful a wizard we mortals can become, we never scratch more than the surface of the weave. Mistra keeps us in check. There are boundaries she doesn't let us cross. Yet, every time I was with her, I stood on the precipice, gazing into the wonders that lay beyond. I sought to cross her boundaries. Okay. Quiet. I tried to convince her. I pouted. I pleaded. I swore my ambition was only to serve her better. But she only smiled and told me to be contented. Inconceivable as it seems to me now, I shared a bed with a goddess. And yet I wasn't satisfied. So I sought to prove myself worthy to her instead. We come now to the crux of my folly. Shall I share the story behind it, or would you rather head straight to its sordid finale? <laughs> I'm intrigued. Well. Here goes. Once upon a very long time ago, a mighty lord lived in a tower. A flying tower, to be precise. I'll save his history for another time, but the gist of it is that he sought to usurp the goddess of magic so that he could become a god himself. And he almost managed, but not quite. And his entire empire, Netheril, came crashing down around him as he turned to stone. The magic that was unleashed that day was phenomenal. Roiling like the prime chaos that outdates creation. Even the weave itself could not withstand the onslaught. It fractured. And shattered, and all magic was lost to the mortal realms until the day Mistra returned. She restored the weave, reuniting all its scattered shards. Or so I thought, until, in the course of my studies, I learned of a book, a netherese tome in which a piece of the fractured weave had been sealed beyond her reach. What if, I thought, what if, after all this time, I could return this lost part of herself to the goddess? Okay. <laughs> so you can't pass 
I was like, I can't do empty a cup of water to the sea. Wow. I thought so. Sometimes there is great strength to be found in symbolism. I was certain that this D of raw power, draped in romance, would convince Mistra to take me by the hand and welcome me into her hitherto forbidden domains. I was mistaken. I obtained the fabled book and took it into my study. As for what happened next, here, place your hand over my heart. Let me show you. You feel the tadpole quiver as you realize Gail is letting you in into the dark. You've seen this before. The book. The black tendrils of chaos weave that lash out and overtake you. The dread is as real as the first time. The impression just as unbearable. This netherese blight, this orb, for lack of a better word, is balled up inside my chest. And it needs to be fed. As long as I absorb traces of the weave from potent enough sources, it remains quiet. Were it ever to fully destabilize, however. <laughs> Rather worse, actually. I will erupt. I don't know the exact magnitude of the eruption, but given my studies of Netherese magic, I'd say even a fragment as small as the one I carry, it'd level a city the size of Waterdeep. Okay. Every waking moment. Every dreaming moment, too. But there was no way out. All of this. It must feel like a betrayal. Say the word, and we'll part ways. Mm -hmm. uh, we've come up uh, this far together, and we will continue on together. That How it will be. A great relief. Oh, a great relief indeed. You truly are a soul that steals my own. From all my new rallied heart, I thank you. I thank you all. I understand if you stand against me. I'm humbled if you stand with me. Either way, I will do my best not to let you down. I stand at a precipice. But if you do not give up hope, neither shall I. I'll fight. I'll resist as long as I can. Now, even I am tired of the sound of my own voice. Let us venture forth. I'm gonna tell her. Okay, forget what the instant for you. Maar vier en gooien. Of het vlucht terug. Ja. 
That's actually a great golden flower. Kind of fish. Dat is gezanig van kip. swims as you close then reopen your eyes how long have you been waiting here a moment a night a ten day can you feel it crawling through you tendrils squirming in your chest gripping your heart piercing your belly your bones popping, your flesh swelling. I can. I see it in you. I feel it in me. We are lost. I will be quick with my blade. First you, then the others, then myself. Your minds intertwine. You sense a touch of uncertainty, a touch of disgust. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, anders zou een critical loss zijn geweest, uh, waar je twee nodig had. Across your vision, and a familiar voice tells you to be calm. You are loved. Lazel's fear grips you. Not fear of death, but fear of insignificance the great warrior lazel a failure to her kind she will wield no silver sword ride no red dragon forever unknown to the great lich queen blacketh mm. i will not let the geek take me I will earn Vlacketh's honor. I will wait. But know this. I am watching. If the sickness does not pass come dawn, I will end us all. I came just in time. You are transforming. Saved you before. Oh. And I'm here to save you again. Don't worry. You will not become a mind flayer. Not while I'm around. I'll protect you. much time so listen closely there is great potential within you it comes from that parasite your instinct is to resist the power it gives but you must accept it nurture it 
I will keep it from consuming you. But for the sake of both of us, you must learn to wield it. For the fate of Faerun, a fight we are losing. For now. You can change that, but only if you embrace your potential. I have to go. The enemy is closing in. I will be back. Uh, we were visited in our dreams by a mysterious figure who promised uh, that our elite parasites are special and source of great potential. Special parasite like it around to its potential and uh, power of our parasite to exert an influence beyond our cells. How far does this power go? Gil heeft een boog, heeft een... Ook, dat is ook niet erg natuurlijk. Oh. 
have. Nah. Alles bezig en dan komen we eindelijk wel even. <laughs> oh, dit point. Dragon Rider, my kin are near. Damn thing could blot out the. Uh huh. Dragon, just. Then I'm by you, huh? Just. Oh, okay. Over here, I'm going to take it. Be I. What are you doing? Hold up before they see you, Magresham. What? Look, down there. That lot are swarming all over the bridge. I don't know what they want, but it can't be good. I'm going to find another way around. You ought to do the same. I doubt a fight against them would go your way. Uh -huh. Nobody. Just another harassing fool trying to stay alive. There's plenty of us around. What? Just follow you around? I go my own way. Alone. Okay. Rag. That's it. I'm getting out of here. Oh. Drop your weapons! I'll feed your innards to the ants before I do that, Istik. This is your, your last chance! No, look up. That was your last chance, Istik. Now burn! Wasting time, Beretta. You're not here to play with the locals. Of course, Kithrak. We merely sought to. No excuses. Question, kill, then move on. Find the weapon. Our queen watches us. Fail her at your peril. A red dragon. I envy its night. Would that I rode such a steed. A crash must be near. Come, my kin await. The dragons serve Githyanki. I'll see it does you no harm. Follow me. We are close to the cure we seek. On my way. What? Back, back. Oh damn! Waar komt die ineens vanaf? Uh. Oh, hij is daar beneden. In één keer. Daar ben ik overbeurend.
Okay, we fought. Oh. Keep a blade close. That's fine. I've wished to live in more interesting times. Okay. Oh, and I can open it. Uh, it's so many, do that. I'll quit. A dragon rider, my kin are near. Damn thing could blot out the sun. Mm -hmm. Never forgot it. Fucked. Die doe het zal ook vast wel een reden uh, <coughs> zijn. Dan gaan we eerst even uh, gewicht uh, naar beneden brengen. So it's true. You scattered the goblins. Peace can finally return to this corner of the as am I. And I'm sure those poor refugees would quite of course. Oi. Yay.
En die kan sowieso weg. May you keep balance. something to ask what are you doing hold up before they see you my Gresham look that lot of I'm going to find I doubt a fight against them would what I go my own way alert nobody just hmm. another harassing fool trying to stay alive there's plenty of us around Rag. that's it I'm getting out of here drop your weapon off this no in the red dragon, a crack. The dragon said, Follow me. What's hiding here? Burned. That's it. Rider, my time is short. Lead me to... Shh, shh, shh. Such a familiar tone. Were I not merciful, I would slice the skin clean from your meat. Yet you are not bleeding. For I am nothing if not merciful. Your name, child. Lazel. Lazel, proud, regal, even. You will call me Gestil Kithrak. Vos, Knight Supreme, the Queen's Silver, the Queen's Sword. I am who you say. A Gaek vessel has fallen from the sky, Lazel. Thieves aboard have taken a weapon most precious. It is polyhedric in shape and inscribed with the sacred runes of our people. You suddenly feel a strange anxiety take hold. Not your own, but that of the artifact you carry. Somehow, it's afraid you attune your mind to it. The artifact does not want to fall into the Gith Raider's hands any more than it does the absolute followers. Take word to your crash. 
You are to join our search. Speak up, child. Affirm your mandate. My mandate to still Kithrak is to locate this crash. I was infected aboard a Geich ship and need to be purified. Your mandate is to aid me. Purified? Soon your skin will go grey and your blood will run silver. You will shed your skin to become Geich. Only in death are the infected cleansed. Boretha, see that her skull is split and the tadpole crushed. Then examine her corpse. I will take word to the undying queen. Our search continues. A current of deception carries Voss's words. Wherever he flies, it is not to Vlakith. To Danos, to the sky! Okay. Uh, you can actually fight you without a void. Move far away from your enemies to unlock the option. That out. Valt wij niet te vliegen? Ik ben al dood voordat ik überhaupt aan de beurt ben. The fuck? Gemaakt. Can't slow down. We moet uh, in ieder geval niet het goed gaan vertellen. Yes. Let's have a look. Anders af kan zonder met haar te praten. Zo gezegd. No. Oh. The red dragon. Okay. Oh. Uh, the dragon. Moving ahead. Kithrak, we must speak. 
Ryder, my time is short. Lead me to... Shh, shh, shh. Were I not mur... Yet you are your name, child. Lazel. Lazel, you will... Voss. I am... Again, it is Polly. You suddenly feel a strange and you achieve... Take... Speak up, child. Affirm your mandate. Even kijken wat gebeurt. Deze optie pakken. You honor me with this duty, Kithrak. I shall alert my caretaker with haste. The Kithrak nods, content with Lazel's answer. You serve your queen well, child. Take your slaves and hunt those who escaped the Geich ship. They must carry the weapon. I fly now to Vlakith, our undying queen. She will see your faith rewarded in this plane and ours. A current of deception <laughs> carries Voss's words. Wherever he flies, it is not to Vlakith. To Danos! To the sky! This is a bit of a You did well to intervene, vexed as I am to admit it. The Gestil Kithrak would have flayed our skin and left our carcasses to burn in the sun. All for the sake of the artifact that we carry. The crash is near, this much we know. We follow the path forward and into the valley. No one, not even the ignoble Gestil Kithrak, will keep me from my purification. Maar kan ik haar niet vertellen dat die... Oeh. Verleunt bij de crash. Oké, okay. daar is het dan wel handig. Maar... Misschien wel weer slim. Sharp as ever. Two steps at a time. Kijk om. Ik dacht ik wil even opwissel. Shadow dingen als ik dat doe kan. Hij dat artefact had al eens Waar is haar wapen? Waarom doet hij de mini unequippen? The Gith Knight is as merciless as the dragon he are you sure? The blade stands at the right and just I 
should speak up. I come in my intent. Something the matter. <laughs> it hurts. Hmm? Worse. But it passes quickly. Usually. It's just an old wound that hurts me from time to time. Nothing to be concerned about. It's nothing to do with the tadpoles, at least. In case your imagination is in danger of getting away from you. It's just... something I have to live with. Quite a lot, if I'm being honest. But it always passes quickly, so I can manage. Positive. You can trust me on that. I know. I don't understand how exactly, but I felt it go to you. It's important. Keep it close. I do, but the artifact has a will of its own and powers to enforce it. It likely won't let me take it back. The best I can do is to stay close, bide my time. Eventually, I'll need to take it. Then I'll have to see what can be done about that. I suppose if we're going to keep helping each other, I might as well tell you. Ah, cake. I was part of a group sent to retrieve it. Bring it to Baldur's Gate for our goddess. I worship Sha, the mistress of the night. It's my mission to deliver the artifact to her secret cloister in Baldur's Gate. <laughs> it hurts. Now that you have the truth, please don't make a big fuss about it. No. Forever, ideally. And you assume too much about what I can and cannot. Secrecy is everything for Shah's children. It is our code, our creed, our shield. I even keep secrets from myself. Huh? I had my memories suppressed, so that nothing I know could be used against the Dark Lady. Once I prove myself, my memories will be restored. I'm not sorry I kept this from you. Not though, perhaps that might change, if you can show an open mind. As I said, Shah is my patron, my mistress, goddess of darkness and loss. I assume you've heard of her? Mm. Well, if that troubles you, perhaps you should fetch the bailiff to arrest me. <laughs> ah, but there's no bailiff here, is there? Just leagues of wilderness and the dangers lurking within. We're in this together, but I'll happily go it alone. My faith will keep me company. Mm. You already know my biggest secrets. What more can you ask? Don't believe the lies the Salunites tell. Hey. Okay. What, besides my life's calling and the greatest problem I've ever faced? Well, I like night orchids and can't swim. Is that the sort of thing you meant? <laughs> 